digital innovations are transforming our societies at an unprecedented speed. This revolution and its impact on jobs was the main topic for students at the 7th EPP study visit in Brussels. Forecasts suggest there will be more than 800,000 jobs available in the technology sector by 2020. But there's a problem. 40% of the population doesn't have the necessary skills to access those jobs. So how can the EU and its regions solve this mismatch? Here are some of the students' ideas. The EU should support the development of a higher education system where the digital skills have a main role. We must provide e-teachers for e-students. European institutions have to work all together at a European, national and a local level to make a real difference. The event, which was hosted by the EPP Group in the Committee of the Regions and the European Democrat Students, was an occasion to share ideas and get a glimpse of political life in Brussels. Normally they read newspapers, they listen to news, and it's more or less abstract. But here they learn a lot about concrete, everyday European policy making. After sharing their favourite apps, the students debated topics such as teaching digital skills, entrepreneurship and innovation. They also got tips from leading experts and politicians. New innovations come mainly with strong citizen involvement. Create your own future, build your strong partnerships. You need somebody who's got some technical skills. You need somebody who's got some business skills. Digital is absolutely everywhere and hence the opportunities for you to involve and embark on careers. After two days of intense debates, they had many stories to bring back home. It's fun to see where the magic happens. To hear all the new creative ideas and also to meet students from other parts of Europe. 